and welcome to uh, Wanna Go Biking. As you can see, I am not in uh, Holland. I'm actually in the Harz region, which used to be pretty much the border between East and Western Germany. And uh, yeah, it's a very beautiful foresty area. Yeah, I've got a, I find myself a nice little apartment over there. It was just very difficult last night in the dark to find my uh, parking lot, because as you can see, there's plenty of parking spaces. And there was one that was uh, destined for me, but the numbering was uh, completely bizarre. There's just no logic behind it. And in fact, my parking lot was the only one that did not have a number. <laughs> so it was very difficult to find in the dark. But all's good now. It is, as you can see, I am, you know, in short sleeves and uh, in my bib shorts, uh, 20 degrees. And this is 28 degrees over. So yeah, it's quite extraordinary, which is why I set out for this uh, long weekend. It's now Friday, so I've got three days of riding. So though today's route is relatively short, around 50k, um, yeah, it's more than 1200 uh, elevation meters to, to overcome, so that's uh, quite something. And probably over very rough terrain as well. And, uh, and again, I have uh, a bit of a late start, so uh, well, no pressure there. I will be visiting the beautiful UNESCO World Heritage uh, City of uh, Goslar, very briefly at least. And uh, other than that, I have no clue, so uh, let's just uh, get moving. See you along the way. Well, first stop of the day, I'm actually going to uh, strip off one layer because it's uh, warm enough. Super! So, um, let's have a look at this little lake. Well, I'm not sure if you can see it, there's a white shield over there with green letters that signifies cycle path. That's the one I'm supposed to take, but I'm on this one. There's just no way to cross over. Uh, pfft, not the best of thinking, really. Right, let's see what's over there. I'm about to enter Goslar. I've been there once before, just for a coffee stop. Uh, I know it has lots of uh, half-timbered houses, and uh, and it is in fact on the UNESCO World Heritage uh, Site. Um, but yeah, obviously I don't have the rest of the afternoon to explore. Um, but we'll just have a very quick look through uh, Goslar and uh, see what we can find. All right, let's do it. Los geht's. Oh, nice old map.
So the early foundations of this uh, castle behind me is actually from 1005. Yeah, beautiful city Goslar, and there's uh, famous mines here. A lot of little villages around here have a little shield that says uh, Gluck auf, which is very much a, a miner's um, saying for good luck, of course. And we actually use that in uh, the south of the Netherlands, in Limburg province, where we used to have mines as well. So uh, maybe it's an international thing by now, I don't know. But I'm just going to gather some, uh, some courage now, and then it's, uh, it's an upward trajectory from now on. All right, see you in a bit. Well, I'd say this is a climb and a half, eh? Wow, <laughs> real, real, keep slipping. It's not good for the nerves. So, oh, yeah, yeah, that's good. <laughs> well, this calls for a little stop. At least it is a stop with a view. Nice. So that's Gosla somewhere down there. If you look closely, you see loads and loads of dead trees. I think I'll have to look it up. That's because of the acidity in this area. Um, yeah, loads of trees have just died. That's of course very bad. That seems to be somewhat mellower. Fingers crossed. Ah, oh, look at this, what a nice hut. Huh. Okay. Ah, oh, it's empty. Hüttenbuch. And some fruit. Oh, lovely. Let's see what's in the book. But what a fabulous day, end of October, 21 degrees, couldn't ask for more, really. Right, um, so I'll just leave this uh, little shelter for now and uh, make my way over there. See you on the road. Maybe actually this was a, a good road, but the tractors have just utterly destroyed it. Mm. Well, I've still got 18 uh, kilometers to go and uh, this is my uh, outlook. That looks very, very steep. And if the road's anything like this, then uh, it's going to be a, a hike and bike again. I did sort of calculate that into my, uh, my ride today to take extra time because I knew I had to take some iffy forest trails. But yeah, I've got two hours of sunlight left. Oh, I hope uh, I can make it before dark. It would be nice to ride here in the dark, wouldn't it? Well, I must have stayed here too long then. Right. Well, unfortunately, I can't find too many alternatives to uh, this route. So that's where we go. Oh well, it's an adventure. Oh, this is the Oka Stausee. Right, last 15k, um, of which is one giant climb, so let's see if we can beat sunset. <laughs> if I have any more of this, I am certainly not going to make it before dark. 13, 14k to go, and I've got an hour, maybe 15 minutes of sunlight. Oh boy. 
It's a good thing I have my mud guards mounted. But uh my poor ball. This is so sketchy. You see these little uh, piggy banks everywhere here. So uh, apparently lots of people are uh, trying to maintain some of these uh, little roads here. So I already gave well, what little money I had at another uh, of these things. But I'll, uh, I'll certainly make amends to my route, uh, to the routes I've planned for tomorrow and, and the day after. Because uh, this is nice, but um, it's not very handy if you want to do 80k or so. Well, uh, we'll see. That's my last stop of the day. Yay! What a day! Woohoo! Ah, look at this. The Liebes Bank. The Lovers Bench. Can I? So I'm not sure if the GoPro can capture the text, but. The Wedding Bench. And as you would have all these locks. <laughs> oh well. But well, a, a bench with a view. Well, I should have thought about that. I could have just uh, jumped on the, on the ski lift with my bike. Uh, well, glad I did it my way. All right, so I'm almost back to, I suppose that's Hanley. What an absolute lovely day. Fantastic. And that late in October, incredible. I hope you liked this little insight in the, in the Harz region and uh, I've got two more days of cycling to go to come, I hope. Let's see if we can make some nice uh, moments from, from those two days. All right, see you later, enjoy your rides, stay safe out there and I'll see you in the next one. Tschüss!